Hi, I'm Matt. I'm the platform manager for LMS. So uh, as you can probably see, the team's been really, really busy uh, this sprint. So I just wanted to uh, call attention to just a couple of things that um, that have landed uh, just in terms of some, some highlights. Uh, no sexy demos, but uh, some cool things nonetheless. Uh, the first one I think I wanted to talk about was uh, in landed in core now in this sprint we've now have uh pls support for uh mysql postgres and uh redis so what does that even mean and why do people care it's all about security um so redis is uh, sort of our primary thing that large sites will use for caching so sort of making things faster and taking the load off the database and mysql and postgres are our two sort of most popular um databases used in uh, Moodle and it, having sort of TLS support between them means that the data that goes between uh, your application code and the database or the cache is encrypted, which is really good. Um, it protects that stuff in transit. Uh, it's, um, it gives you a much better security in, in distributed systems. So where your database and your application servers are not on the same physical machine, they're in different sides of the data center. Uh, or in different physical locations even these days. Uh, and it's also often a uh, security requirement in procurement. So our people uh, on our services team who are actually you know, making money selling the product, uh, this often comes up. And it's either a yes or no requirement, you either meet it or you don't, and now we do, which is really, really cool. Uh, it also adds to our uh, MS SQL support, which had this functionality uh, about a release ago. Um, I probably got that horribly wrong in terms of timing, but now that we've brought MySQL and Postgres up for it, we've got really good coverage. Uh, it was also really, really highly voted. It had about 50 votes for the Postgres and MySQL part of that, so it was good to land. Uh, it was also um, one of our partner contributions, which is awesome to see. And not only was it sort of contributed by a partner, it was really highly requested by our partners as well. So that's part of that sort of procurement requirement. So it's good to be able to help them out. 